Mom, I don't want chicken tenders. I want popcorn chicken. Fuck. Yo, what's going on, Pomegranate Gang? Today, we, I got a new video for you guys. It's a good video. So in this video, we're gonna talk, let me take this shit So in today's video, we're gonna be talking about a video called Basketball Training, Jump Higher Basketball Training. I swear to God. By e House Sports. We have returned. But before we get into this juicy, tasty, little salty video, I wanna give a quick shout out to the sponsor of today's video, Amino. Now Amino, actually, Amino Hardwood. Amino Hardwood is the name of the app. Amino Hardwood is the perfect app for any NBA fan. I mean, you can just see, there's a whole featured page, there's polls, quizzes, player profiles, uh, featured posts. The featured posts are really cool. Like for example, here's a featured post, which is the biggest MJ legacy knock? And as you can see, it's a really, really well-written post. There's like sections. Uh, really detailed. It's a really cool. It's not just like two three sentence misspelled everything forum post It's really detailed stuff like these are good writers writing this also Which is cool to participate in all the polls and quizzes just a fun thing to do if you're an NBA fan Anyway, make sure you guys check out Amino Hardwood I'll put all the links in the description now. Let's get back to this video now Like I said before the video we're gonna be talking about is called basketball training colon jump higher basketball training um, Without fail eHouse sports every single time will come through with the most unique Detailed descriptive titles if I worked at eHouse sports and somebody came up to me and said hey We just made this video on how to jump higher and we need you to title it. We need you to give it a unique title Basketball training jump higher basketball training would not be the first idea that comes into my head This guy is very unique very creative really thinks outside the box and that is why I love eHouse sports eHouse sports starting to become one of my favorite how-to sports basketball channels mainly because they have really good and qualified Experts who also can speak really well and teach what they're trying to convey really well the line of two offensive players And that that means you're in between two offensive players and they're trying and you're in, you're trying to and that that mean and they're trying and you're in, you're trying and that that mean and if you guys watched the last video I uploaded before this which was also a video on eHouse sports I made fun of the way a man dressed god damn. What are those boys? Jesus Christ the white socks with that what gray tan Sketcher sandal croc looking combination and um, I felt kind of bad for that And I, I'll promise I won't make sure to make fun of how anyone looks or dresses ever again It was really inappropriate to me. Trust me. That won't happen again Hi boy, why you look like an evil villain who got a curse placed on him to turn into an evil mouse with those fucked up ears and that shitty goatee Where the hell are your eyebrows? <clears throat> I mean, um Hi, I'm coach Roger today. We're going to work on learning how to jump higher in basketball. Before I watch the rest of this video, I don't like to make assumptions, and I don't make assumptions. This video was full of unbiasedness. I only use pure facts. You can't jump high. You have my professional guarantee, backed by no experience at all, that this guy does not jump high. Maybe if he was a cat, because cats can jump pretty high, but he's a mouse. Mouses don't jump, I think. Now the first drill that I want you to do is find yourself a nice wall. A nice wall? These are all pretty shitty walls. All of my walls are dicks to me. I need a nice wall. I know there's a wall at the Walmart down the street, but it doesn't really treat me right all the time. Oh, you know what? This is a nice wall. I can just get a plane ticket, come to this one. All right, got it. Got my nice wall. I'm gonna get a plane ticket there and then I'm gonna see what else I have to do. Get right next to it. Reach as high as you can on the wall and find out where that is and kind of mark that in your mind. Okay, so material number one, you're gonna need a nice wall. Make sure it's not a dick, a nice one. And then you also need uh, photographic memory because you have to memorize exactly where your hand goes on that nice wall. You can't mark it, you have to memorize it in your head. I have a nice cinder block wall that's got lines so I can tell. If you don't, put a piece of tape up. Put a piece of tape up. Kinda mark that in your mind. Put a piece of tape up. Kinda mark that in your mind. Put a piece of tape up. Do I mark it with my mind or do I mark it with the tape? You gotta be clear with this stuff. Now the drill is once we have that line marked, is then to jump up and touch as high on the wall as we can. We want to do it 10 times in a row, and we want to just spring from our legs. So it looks like this. 10 times. Now, when we do that, 10 times forward, then we want to turn around so we're using the opposite hand and doing it 10 times backwards. The important part- <laughs> Why didn't you demonstrate the 10 times backwards? To be honest, I'm gonna be honest with you, I think he got tired. Actually, no, he's not, he's not tired. This guy's a mouse, mouses don't get tired. What actually happened was that he jumped up 10 times on the wall and then the wall stopped being nice to him. So to demonstrate the next 10, he had to travel to China 
and buy a plane ticket, and that's too much of a hassle. He was like, screw it, I'm just gonna tell you what to do, I'm not gonna demonstrate the next time. The important part of this is that you wanna do that religiously three times a day. And you're gonna notice that eventually, when you jump up, you're gonna be higher on that wall at probably every week. You'll be a little bit higher, until eventually, you may even dunk a basketball. Pause. That was perfect. Let me explain what I love about that. I love the way he says, you may even dunk a basketball. Like, so demeaning, so downward speaking, I love it. You may even dunk a basketball. You may even dunk a basketball. I know that if you're watching this, you're probably a 5'2", 14 year old white kid who can't even get two inches off the floor, but if you try this method, you may be able to dunk. If you buy a plane ticket to China and jump 10 times on that wall every single day, you may be able to dunk. Oh, you're wondering why I'm not dunking right now in this video? Well, it's because a witch turned me into a mouse. And so I can't jump anymore, but if I would have just jumped on a wall of China seven times a day, I would have easily dunked. And eventually you may be able to dunk too. God, I'm, I'm giving this guy more shit than I feel like he deserves, but it's just any fucking person on any of these how-to, e-how channels, the stupidest fucking advice I hear every single time. And I love it, I can't wait to watch more. Now the second technique is the one you're gonna really see the improvement on. You want- <laughs> What was that smile, dude? You guys are e-how sports, you're one of the biggest companies in the world it's it's google apple ehouse sports you guys should be at the top of the line with this editing software you could just edit that one second of him smiling out now the second technique is the one you're going to really see the improvement on you want to choose either the backboard the rim or the net you need to do this from both sides and you need to do it three times a day for me why does he keep cutting to all these angles literally in the span of 10 seconds it cut from one two Three, four different angles. Two things could have happened here. Number one is they were like, hey, let's get a bunch of cool different camera angles for all these ADD 14 year old kids watching us. But that would have been weird because the whole first minute of this video was the same angle. Until eventually, you may even dunk a basketball. Or what else happened is that this dude was just really, really fucking up his lines. You want to choose either the backboard, the rim, or the net. You want to choose either the backboard, the rim, or the net. I think slavery was cool. Cut, cut it again, God damn it, Rod. You need to do this from both sides, and you need to do it three times a day. For me, because I'm older, I can only reach the net. And it looks something like this. Remember, throw that leg up when you jump. Okay. <laughs> oh my God, I feel like I'm in a fever dream. Look, I'm not hating that he's old. I'm not, I'm not making fun of him because he's old. Why have him, if he's old and can't jump, why have him be the expert for how to jump higher? You could have got fucking Travis Corpening. He was dunking in the How to Steal video. You could have used him for how to jump higher. Hi, this is Travis Corpening. I feel, I swear, I swear to God, I felt fine before this video. I feel like I'm losing my mind watching this. Just fucking end it already. Okay, if you do both of those 10 times, three times a day, you'll improve how high you can jump. Why is he so out of breath? Three times a day, you'll improve how high you can jump. My man, you jumped 10 times. You jumped 10 times on the wall, took probably like a 45 minute break because you messed up all your lines, and then you jumped one time to reach the net. You are so fucking out of breath. I know you're old, but uh, have me. Have me be the e how expert. I can jump higher, look at this video. I can't dunk either, it's better than this dude. God damn, man, just pay me like $20, I'll do it. Wow. For a video like this, this video's like to dislike ratio is fucking good. What the f- Let me read to you guys this description really quick. Learning how jump higher can help you take great leaps forward in your basketball trainings as you work toward that game winning slam dunk. Learn a helpful jumping height drill in this free video on basketball training. Expert Roger Anderson, bio. Roger Anderson, a high school coach and PE teacher has spent most of his life playing a variety of sports. Currently he teaches PE while coaching several sports at two different schools. <laughs> the expert on how to jump higher, a PE teacher. I love this last sentence here. A professional coach explains and demonstrates in this free video series. Ah, oh, this is great. Well, anyways, guys, that's the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Shout out again to Amino for sponsoring this video. And I'm gonna disappear into hell. I'll see you in hell. I'm just looking for the time that I lose almost every day. Single time right now without seeing your face